Hello, wherever you are, and whatever you're doing. I hope this finds you well. If I look a wee bit distracted, it's because just a second or two ago, I've been watching in my garden a red squirrel having its breakfast on the middle of the, the, the grass in our back garden. The squirrel, by the time I took the camera off this computer to try and film it for you, disappeared up the side of the house to where we have nuts at a bird table. It was replaced by a red, uh, a male pheasant in all its glory, squawking away wanting its breakfast too. Easy be distracted, and I give thanks for the beauty of nature that around us. But I brought something else from nature to show you. I brought, and I know you won't be able to see this, but it's a tiny little jar, and it's actually of lavender seeds. Every year I grow lavender in a pot in the garden, and at the end of the flowering season I cut the flowers down, and we put them into a flower arrangement of dried flowers simply to give a bit of scent. During the week, it was decided that these flowers had passed their best, and that the seeds were beginning to fall, and we were going to recycle them. And I thought, no, no, I will strip all the seeds off them and see if there's any scent. And I can tell you, <coughs> there is quite a bit of scent still coming from these when they're concentrated together. I brought them into this dining room that we have where I do my filming and put them on a desk behind me. I had to move them. As you can see, <coughs> the scent uh, irritates me because it's concentrated. I put them to another corner of the room where we have a Welsh dre dresser, put them high on the top of that thinking that would just give the slight scent in the room. It still bothered me. The final resting place so far is out in the hallway on a table at the bottom of our stairs so that it, the scent s gently percolates through the upstairs and downstairs of our house. It's a lovely smell until it's so concentrated that it really goes for my nose, as I'm sure you'll see in a second. <coughs> Excuse me. But it's, it, it's got that fragrance that's uplifting, helpful, and just a gentle when it's not concentrated totally. Do you know, you and I can be our own fragrances. We can brighten up areas or we can be in people's faces. It's hard to get the right balance. I do hope whatever you're doing, you are a sweet-smelling fragrance for your family, for your friends, for your community. Folks, in a few weeks' time, I hope to be able, or less than a few weeks' time, I hope to be able to announce that we will be trying to reopen our churches where we shall see each other face to face. So in the meantime, all I would say about that is watch this space. And if you can, be a sweet-smelling fragrance to those you love. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and may God bless you, his face shine upon you, and give you peace. Bye-bye.